Well, the apes have been working on touchscreens now for almost seven years. And up till this point, they've been working on sequencing data that are putting specific items in order. Now, some of our subjects have graduated from that task. They're able to put nine items in order, and now they're moving to a short-term memory task. What we're trying to do is get a better idea by looking at how apes use these touchscreens of how they see the world around them. We're interested in how they perceive objects, how they perceive the relationship between objects. So by giving them these tasks, we're able to get some insights into how they order their environment. All of our cognitive research here is completely voluntary. They can perform on these tasks or they can walk away. That's one of the really nice aspects of the research we do here. This is a particularly difficult task and at its highest levels, it's difficult even for humans to com successfully complete the task. What we've seen so far is it's easy to be able to go from very short lists to what we'd call medium length lists. What will be very challenging now is to see if he can remember the items when they reach list lengths of six, seven, eight. Then we're starting to talk about tasks that are difficult for any ape, including humans.